Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome into the St. John's County Show that's on in the afternoon. We are going back in time today. Cowabunga, dude! Hop in the freaking DeLorean and let's do this, <laughs> let's man. Let's go! We've got Kelly Lyon joining us from Pub Crawl STA. You. We're talking back to the 80s. Pub Crawl, it's coming right up. I'm ready. People love these pub crawls. So fun. It's very fun, man. And a good rally for downtown businesses, too. I love yes, this moment. Yes, totally. Really cool. yeah. Totally. So we'll talk to Kelly about that. And uh, it's going to be a fun show. It's going to be a great show. Of course, we got your horoscopes, your events, and all that good stuff you're used to. So let's jump right into it. All right. All right. We will start by telling you about our friends at Bozard Ford Lincoln. Nice. Yeah. Um, 76 years here in St. Augustine in Northeast Florida. They are truly here for you. You can experience a massive selection of new and pre-owned vehicles, quick and quality servicing, as I make way too much noise with my keys that I realize are still on the table. <laughs> Maybe that's a sign that I need to go to Bozard Ford Lincoln and get a new vehicle. Their keys don't make noise. Well, I don't think they promise that, but uh, <laughs> it's possible. It's, they might. <laughs> go check it out. See. Check it out. Let me know. And if you're hanging out, waiting for your answer on the keys, you can stop by Ford's Garage and get a great burger out there. Bozard Ford Lincoln, where your family is their family, and they are driven to inspire. Yeah, they are. Also, our great friends at the Bailey Group, they provide custom solutions for happy, healthy employees. Oh. Building the perfect plan to attract high-performing and loyal employees is tough. Making sure that plan meets legal, regulatory, and other requirements is even harder. If you need a program that's customized for you, let me answer that question for you. You do need a program that's customized for you. All of us do. Yep. Not an off-the-shelf package. Uh, one that's designed for your size, your location, your number of employees, the demographics, the type of businesses. It all depends on having the right perspective, a local perspective that can see the bigger picture as well as those intricate details that affect your business and your everyday life. Mm -hmm. That's where the Bailey Group comes into the picture, bringing you the right people, the right tech, the right experience, and the insights that can help you see and do so much more. They want to take the headaches out of the process for you and make it simple, make you feel comfortable with your decision. 904-461-1800. And speaking of feeling comfortable, how about a Lace Med Spa? Oh, yeah. If you were looking for a rejuvenating, relaxing experience, look no further than a Lace Med Spa. They specialize in providing their clients with a range of luxurious spa treatments and advanced medical aesthetics procedures. Whether you're looking to unwind with a hydrofacial, very popular out there, or enhance your natural beauty with things like uh, Botox, dermal fillers, laser treatments, all that good stuff. They are the best. They have high standards because you have high standards. They are a lace med spa. Check them out at elace.com. Big laser treatment um, mm. sale going on. Check out their socials. So if you have a hairy back, they'll laser that right out. You'll be good to go. Okay. Yep. Sweet. Kelly Lyon joins us. There's <laughs> no transition from Harry back into Kelly Lyon. That she's great transition. She's back in studio. Hey, hey. There she is. Welcome back, Kelly. We can't say the word back now. No. I feel like it's just. Oh, how are you this afternoon? I'm doing well. Thank you very much for having me. Good. Yeah. Glad you could be in. Uh, today we're talking back. To the 80s, the pub crawl. Oh, it's a famous one. Harry backs are all over the 80s. That's are they saying. really? Okay. Yeah. How are you doing? <laughs> so well, I can go in there and just add some extra hair to the back. That's and I'll it? be okay. right. I'll sure. fit yeah. in perfectly. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> oh, not the intro I'm sure she was expecting That's here today, but chains. it's okay. I mean, the look yeah. is very big for the 80s. Yeah. yeah. It really is. But the 80s are making a comeback. They are. They're, They're making They're a comeback in a big way. Lately. Yeah. Yeah. So what made you want to do an 80s themed pub crawl? Mm. Um, we decided upon doing this last year. We started okay. with the 80s 
you have uh, the As If 90s Fest that happens that weekend. So mm -hmm. we kind of wanted to do like a parade of the decades. Oh, okay. So you do Thursday, you do the 80s pub crawl, and mm -hmm. then you go to the 90s Fest on the weekend. Oh, so. my gosh. After hours is the 70s. Right? How perfect. Exactly. Hey, <laughs> there you go. Like it, like yeah. it. There you go. So what can we look forward to at, uh, at the 80s pub crawl? What's this going to look like? So the 80s pub crawl is everyone is a themed person. You can be whoever you want. Last year, I was run DMC hip hop style. Nice. Okay. Um, we had a lot of people in spandex and windbreakers and you name it. Mm -hmm. They were in it. Um, then we go through the streets of downtown with our sponsors who are Me Hands, Prohibition Kitchen, to name a few. Mm -hmm. And then we end the night with a big group photo at the city gates. Which is awesome. Yeah. These are iconic photos. They are. They are. And they are done by um, Marvin from Memories by Marvin. How cool. So it's a professional photographer. And then we email that out to everyone who signed up first. And that's your keepsake for the evening. We also do the uh, best dress contest. So you can win $100. Oh, hey, there the you go. Costume. Ooh, so. Who are the judges for something like that? Um, we kind of just pick three or four people out of the audience and the crowd does it. We cool. do it by claps. So that way no one can say, oh, we got left out or, oh, we yeah, didn't yeah. get to vote. Everyone is voting on what you see. I love that. So. Great. It's an all inclusive Great. moment for exactly. people. Yes. And it gets everybody riled up. Nice. <laughs> okay. So how does the route work? Are you hmm. still kind of working out the route or you got this down yet? Um, so the route is a secret. You don't oh, get that into the Oh, it is a secret route. Of. Okay. That's part of register. String, so you just don't hop on. You okay. register, and then oh. we send you the route the seat the week of, and then everybody meets at that location, and we start our pub crawl. That makes sense. We welcome people who want to sign on the day of. You're more than welcome. If you see us pub crawling, you're dressed like 80s, come on in. Nice. Find me. I'll give you a little wristband, and go about our day. Throw it hey, in a side easy. pony and just you know, get on board. Exactly. Where would you suggest people to park for that evening? Like, it's a parking garage? Like, That's is that a good, good question. spot? Yeah, so it's Thursday evening, which isn't too bad in downtown St. Augustine mm -hmm. as of yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we're still on that cusp. Yeah. And you can park at the parking garage. I use the park app. Um, heads up, there's two different park apps. So nice see which out. one you're using. Yeah. Because there's the downtown city one owned by the city. Yeah. And then there's like the private lot lot park apps. Oh, right. But like <laughs> yeah. over, yeah, uh, yeah. over by Columbia, there's a private right, lot over there too. Right. Okay. So Completely different to pricing. So make sure you're aware of what right. you're playing. No. Yes. Yes. Thanks for yeah. telling us that. Yeah. But I use that and I'm always able to find somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Just off street real quick. Yeah. Yeah. So where did the whole pub crawl start? Things start um, with you. This is what, five years? Yeah. No? Is it really? So which is this year will be year five. It'll be a big one, hopefully. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Really? Fun Thank event. You. So it started with Witches Night Out um, in downtown St. Augustine. We had like seven people. Then it went to 13 people. Then it went to 75 people. <laughs> then it went to almost, what, 200 last year? Wow. That's huge. Yeah. And it just kind of has formulated into something more, you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. and I'm, yeah. I'm okay with that. People were like, why don't you start and do this more? I was like, you know, people like to dress up <laughs> and they like to drink. And that's the thing about the pub crawl. You're really not on a set route. You can spread out. You can do what you want. The bars are small. Yeah. Just be at the photo, you mm -hmm. know, that's the best part. And that's where we do the best dress contest as well is at the photo. So I can imagine for like the businesses downtown, like a lot of them that you're listing, like I really kind of gives them a jolt of uh, business for that that evening, especially on a Thursday night, which right. is a slower night for most for most of these bars. And it gets the locals downtown. Um, you're there in the bar for about 30 minutes. We're not taking up too much of your time. And then you're kind of spreading out to the next bar. Cool. Um, we recommend eating before. Yeah, Because it's not really not like tasting tours where you sit down. Yeah. It's like you're getting a drink and we're moving on to the next yeah. place. You, you know? a little bit of chips to soak it up a little bit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah or right? a taco at like 10 o'clock at night when yeah. you're done during the taco shop. It's a blessing. It's nice. <laughs> and all of the pub crawls you do are themed, right? Everybody dresses up. Everybody... And everyone's very much into it. You would oh, be yeah. surprised. Oh, Men yeah. and women. I've had a baby pirate on our pirate pub crawl. Oh, so I was like, can our kid come? I was like, uh, it's bars, but <laughs> sure. And the baby was adorable as a little pirate. And what's good about St. Like Augustine downtown, most of the bars, except for a few, are family situated because it is geared to a tourist. Yeah, so you yeah. know mm -hmm. that you can bring sure. your kids in there it's the and South. it's not yeah. exactly. Yeah. Well. I, saw, I saw Sweet Home Alabama. They were like, you have a baby. <laughs> well, you That's know, normal, boo. Yeah. It's a different city for us. <laughs> 
<laughs> Very um, cool. So where do people go to find more information, keep up with you, reach out, be a part of this? Sure. You can register at www.pubcrawlsta.com. All one word. Mm. Okay. There's a link to Back to the 80s Pub Crawl right there. Um, you can reach out to us on Facebook. Our number's on the website. We have a website. You can find us Sweet. anywhere. Where so. do I find really good 80s gear? So mm, mm, Good question. There's a few places. There's always like Party City has some fun stuff, like where mm -hmm. you get the mesh and you yeah, can add it yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, yep. If you want to do like the holographic looks, yeah. you know. Um, I'm oh, such an Amazon girl. I'm like, hmm. Yeah, right. What can I find from Amazon that's <laughs> yeah. 80s? And then it's fun to see the creativity. Like yeah. I would love to see an 80s style wrestler come out or I would oh, love to see yeah. something like that instead of your usual... I love the neon, but yeah. the usual neon. Right, right, right. Jane Fonda looks. So exactly. get creative as you want. Get yes. as creative as you want with Wear this. Wear the blazer with the open. Yeah, go yeah. all the way. Shoulder there you go. Yes. Yeah, right. Make them bigger than your ears. <laughs> oh, I love it. Yes. Uh, Serving dynasty. Yes. And that's the fun part. Like, we're there from 7 to 10. You can go about your way. You can do your own thing. You can leave early, go to bed. Mm. Like, we're not trying to keep you all night. That's the freedom of it. Like, you can be there and enjoy what bar you want to enjoy. Yeah, yeah. We just have the ones that certainly sponsor us. And then we have the group photo at the end. That's your keepsake. Fantastic. So. Oh, we also, we just picked a charity. I'm going to go ahead and put that out there. Okay. It hasn't been on the flyers because I was kind of on the fence on who I wanted to mm -hmm. do this year because each year I plan to donate to a different one. Yeah. We're going to do to the Huntington Disease Society, and oh. that's a study of a degenerative disease that does lead to death for many. Mm -hmm. um, it's a breakdown of the... It's the medulla back here. Is You're that right. correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the breakdown of the brain tissues in there. And it starts with leading to like the slurring of the speech, to the shaky hands, to the total immobility. Wow. So I figured it would be a great one to send a it's few an money. Amazing to one to be able to support. I'm mm. sure that they would be really appreciative of exactly. yeah, any kind of effort that's going out there. Yeah. Exactly. It's still incurable. Um, they're trying to find many studies, many drug studies are happening to help slow the process down while mm. they try to find a cure for it. So, and it's been around for many, many years. People just kind of pushed it aside and thought it was like Alzheimer's or Parkinson's mm. or a segment of that. Yeah. Yeah. This is a great thing to support. Absolutely. Yeah. And it's like something that's in your biology. You are oh, born with it. It's not something genetic. you catch. Oh. Exactly. And you don't know you have it until you're older. Jeez. Oh, wow. So the $15 well, that great. you spend to get, to be a part of this, I mean, honestly, uh, if, if you can't be there, it's still a great donation. Too, exactly. At the same time. Okay. To mm -hmm. the Huntington Disease Society. That's awesome. Yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Well, Kelly, it sounds like a lot of fun. I it know is. these are a lot of fun. People love doing them. They do. Uh, you've got something really great here. So, um, very cool. Yeah. I'm looking you know, forward I love to this. event planning. It's so much fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a giant yeah. puzzle putting it all together. <laughs> giant puzzle that'll give you a headache like you've never had before in your life. You had your first toe dip in this year. Oh, boy. <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah. All right. Good stuff. Kelly, thank you for coming by. Yeah. Always thank fun. You. So fun. Appreciate it. Pub crawl STA, get on all of their, get on all the crawls. Yeah. All the crawls. Always We're always fun. listening like for more sponsors, more bars who want to jump on because oh, St. Augustine's tiny. You got to spread out. And yeah. When I have people around 200 to 300, I can't fit them all in one area, people. Right, right, right. right. I would really love to bring you the money. Keep the flow. <laughs> yeah. Keep it going. I like it. Yeah. So good. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you, Kelly. Can't Thank wait you. for this. This is going to be Fabulous. awesome. Thanks, Thanks, boo. Man, anytime we can dress up like 80s or 90s people. Hey, we got I'm it in, in for stock. It. I was like, where can you find it? I'm like, my closet. I got it here, yeah. <laughs> yeah, right? I didn't want to say that, but that was me as well. I'm like, that's what's in trend right now. What are you talking about? I know, about? right? Everything. Just put it in a pony. Let's go. I'm also big on thrift store shopping. So oh. I love an opportunity to get out to a thrift store oh, for nice. any excuse I can. Oh, nice. yeah. yeah. I'm always weird yeah. about wearing yes. people's other clothes. Yeah, well, I don't wear them normally. Only for like a one-time thing. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. You still well, I think it's because yeah. I read that story where the like girl died in the white dress when we were little and yeah. then the white dress was like toxic was, do you like, remember that yeah i don't remember that but that's one thing i always worry about going to thrift stores is <laughs> yeah who died and this was their prized possession and are they sure. coming with me to my house you know yeah yeah oh. yeah i think about that <laughs> sorry there's You're something called the wash you can wash wash the items yeah you well can you can't wash them. a ghost away <laughs> You it doesn't work. It doesn't work like that. Sage. <laughs> Can you wash right. the death off the clothes? Right? Yeah. I think they're living a new life. That's all. Oh, that's a good. <laughs>
All right, Old Town Trolley. Hey! Oof. Talk okay. about a new life. If you want to tour St. Augustine and hit uh, 22 stops, 100 points of interest on a 90-minute tour. A 90-minute tour Very where you have nice. no chance of getting lost at sea. No. you got to go out to our friends at Old Town Trolley. Uh, and if you are a St. Augustine resident, you are going to tour for free as long as you bring a full fare adult paying guest with you and you have signed up for the Hometown Pass program, which is super easy. Just go to hometownpass.com and uh, get yourself on a green train ASAP. They're the green trains. We love them. You will too. And get yourself involved with Steve Chapman's All-American Air. They've been serving St. Augustine and St. John's County for over 45 years. They take great pride in servicing our community. They have great maintenance plans. They also, if you build, have a new building, they have new construction installations, as well as all of your HVAC products. When was the last time you had your home unit service or inspected? Give Steve Chapman's All-American Air a call, 904-461-0070, and get on one of those maintenance plans. Yeah. If your filter is gray... It should be changed today. Yes, sir. And, of course, our friends at Bin 39 oh. Wine Bar. Great little wine bar located right there in the lobby of the St. George Inn mm -hmm. in downtown St. Augustine. Uh, great staff down there who wants to help you find your new favorite wine. And if you found your new favorite wine, guess what? Hmm. There may be a new new favorite wine True. that you can discover out there at Bin 39 with over 95 wines for you to sample and choose from and just enjoy throughout mm, the day. 91. I bought four bottles this week. Sorry, everybody. Oh, Sorry, okay. Everybody. Yeah, 91. <laughs> Well, I'm sure they will be replenishing those very, very soon. Yeah, it could take some time. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, there you go. With a selection of definitely over 90 wines. There it is. <laughs> they can help you out uh, out there at Bin 39. You're just going to love your experience, too. If you've got questions about wine, they love to answer those questions mm. for you as well. 904-827-5740. All right, Davey, you're on deck for Horror Scopes today. All right, see you later. Yeah. All right, well, bye. <laughs> yep. Your horoscope said you were going to do that. Oh, good. You See? will get up and leave at your... No. <laughs> Scorpio and Sagittarius today. Let's do this, Clay. Scorpio. Today, your sting is extra venomous. Mm -hmm. Consider giving your foes and friends fair warning. Or don't. And watch the chaos unfold with popcorn in hand. Won't start one, won't be none. <laughs> Sagittarius. You're usually up for an adventure, but today you might find that the greatest adventure is trying to get out of bed. Mm. <clears throat> Man, that's the yeah. toughest thing to do every day. Aim for the bathroom. <laughs> it's a start. Just roll. <laughs> <laughs> roll into the bathroom. <laughs> Hopefully your bathroom's not downstairs. That'd be a painful <laughs> roll. All oh, right. my. Hey, Pete, are you seeking a sustainable approach to spring and refresh your life? Sure. Well, join them at the Jimenez Fascio house for a <laughs> spring cleaning clothing swap. These ah. are very trendy nowadays. This okay. is very cool. So this is happening May 3rd. Save the date 3 to 9. Uh, the Jimenez Fascio House Museum. Of course, we know where that is downtown. But yeah, they're, they're doing a giant clothing uh, swap. So admission is free. Uh, you can check out more on their socials. I'll put link in comments. But yeah, May 3rd, 3 to 9. Okay, just don't swap dead people's clothes. Yeah, well, you might want to sage them a little bit before you go. I mean, you know, some of those dead people, there's like vintage Gucci. You'd be going to throw that away? No. Well, maybe you end up with a good ghost, too. See, yeah. Not all ghosts are bad. Absolutely. And not all events are bad, like this next one, Touch a Truck 2024. Come on, man. <laughs> this is going to be amazing. Saturday, May 18th, 11 to 2 p.m. This is happening at Trailmark Living. Very, very cool. Uh, check them out. I'll put link in comments. This is a free family fun construction trucks, military trucks, police and safety vehicles, and so much more, plus food trucks, face painting, music, and games. St. John's County's biggest vehicle fest, Touch a Truck. Free family fun, May 18th. Very nice. Wow, your breathing really sells it for me. <laughs> <laughs> no, it sounds great. It sounds great. Or you can <laughs> have a day with your kids and go around the town touching different trucks right. if you want to. <laughs> well, this is where it's all here, and these are uh, these are different Take a field trip. trucks. Very cool. <laughs> uh, I'm sure it'll be great. <laughs> well, this is also great, too. Don't forget the May 8th through the 12th World Golf Village Renaissance Resort presents the St. Augustine Food and Wine Festival. It is, uh, it is here right around the corner. This is brought to you by our friends at Bozart Ford Lincoln. So, yeah, the 2024 St. St. Augustine Food and Wine Festival is set against the backdrop of one of the nation's most scenic and historic cities. We know this already. So yeah, check out everything there. I'll put the link in comments and uh, it's going to be amazing. Uh, Food and Wine Festival. Yay. All right. There you go. Food and Wine. Yay. There you go. What we love. Who doesn't? Mm -hmm. Food and Wine. 
We also love Panache, oh. and you will love yourself, and you will love your mother, damn it, <laughs> at the Love Your Mother Eco Fashion Show. Coming mm -hmm. up in just about a week and a half. <laughs> yeah. Yes. The following Saturday, <laughs> next Saturday, the Saturday after this Saturday. Correct. Could have just said the 27th, Pete. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be great. <laughs> uh, it's going to be a whole lot of fun. Davey himself is uh, the MC out there at the Love Your Mother fashion show. We've got a lot of wardrobe situations going on. Really? How oh. many wardrobe changes are you looking at? <sighs> we had four. And wow. Now we've whittled it down to two, but yeah. Where do you find time to change your wardrobe four times? That's the issue. Yeah. yeah. So that's why we're trying to get the timing down. Uh, Michelle's outfit. She's got to go back to start. I mean, we're, we're, having, oh, no. some, we're having some hiccups here. We've oh, got to set prayers up here. we got to find it. You gotta get out there just for the suspense of the hiccups and yes. how they roll out. Oh, I made Mike Davis blush over the pants that I'm wearing. Yes. Really? Real wow. mess. Yes. Who's Mike Davis? Oh, Mike Lewis's people. Thank you. People. There oh, it now is. I there understand. It is. Now I get it. Yeah. <laughs> Get posh and go to getpanache.com and check out where you can get the tickets and how you can participate. If there's still any tickets left, I yeah. don't know if there's tickets left. Seriously. Go to getpanache.com and see. The difference. I don't know. Uh, the motivated difference, maybe. There you go. <laughs> when St. John's County opened, the United Way opened in 1957, it was known as the Community Chess. That was the first year, of course, where they raised $48,000. Well, the United Way of St. John's has changed a lot, but... Their focus hasn't. Today, with a total impact of over $3 million annually, they continue to fight for the areas of health, education, and financial stability of every person in our community, doing some really cool book programs with the Scholastic Book Fairs um, in our Title I schools. Check them out today. Volunteer your time. UnitedWay-SJC.org. All right, sir. How are we uh, ending the show today? All right. Totally 80s. It's the theme today. We okay. got funny and nostalgic memes of today's kids probably won't understand. Oh, uh, wonderful. This first one. I'm old enough to remember the very first TED Talk. It was most excellent. Oh, yeah. yeah. I was never a huge fan of Bill and Ted. Oh, I thought you would have been. Yeah. No, too stonery for you. <laughs> Maybe back then. And next, uh, next up, cashier checks my ID in a half a second. Wow, that was fast. <laughs> yeah, I saw the 19... Yeah. Uh, Mm. Next up, never-ending story when I was a kid, and now the never-ending story as an adult. Was oh, it dishes and laundry? Totally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Next up, only in the '80s could this kid turn into a wolf in the middle of a basketball game and then finish the game. Right, yes. <laughs> right. right. Who's just letting that fly? It's just no big deal. It's crazy. Next up, Millie Vanilli watching people famous for lip syncing on TikTok. Oh, yeah. 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 Well, they had their fame for lip syncing, too. They, they can't were. get too mad about Pioneers it. Pioneers in the industry. That's right. Didn't get any royalties, though. <laughs> well, Next you up, can't. Yeah, yeah, no. You never forget the feeling of this getting your shin. I yeah. know. The spiky ones. I will never not be able to feel that feeling upon request. Right. Yeah. Next up, eight-year-old me sliding my straw in the, out of a McDonald's cup. Yeah, like a fiddle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Next up, I want a movie where Dolly Parton and Elvira play estranged sisters who have to team up and fight evil together. With what, their boobs? I think so. Okay. I think that would be the guns. All right. The guns. Next, right. <laughs> next up, when I was a kid, this was my curfew. Yeah. Yeah, true. Yep. yep. And last, the single reason why my generation is tougher than yours. We survived those things. <laughs> those were death traps. Right. Parents, Literal death traps. No complaining from parents either. <laughs> right. You ever try to jump on one of those while it's going fast? So stupid. Dumb idea. Dumb idea. <laughs> Among many dumb ideas that I had as a kid. <laughs> yeah. All right. Good stuff, man. Good show. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Um, thank you guys out there for watching. Clay for pressing all the buttons. And we will talk to you guys tomorrow morning. Bye, everybody.